I uh, am so happy you read it yourself. I get angry when someone else reads someone who I'm like, come on, he can talk. Yeah, I I enjoy reading my books myself, and and what I've what I've learned from feedback I get from audiences at presentations is people like me doing that. Oh yeah, for sure. Yeah, yeah, a hundred percent. It's just weird when someone else is talking in your voice. Like, hey man, I know you're not Graham. You know that I write fiction as well as yes. nonfiction. Yeah, and the one thing I can't read is my fiction. Really? Because, well, yeah, because fiction requires accents. You really need an actor yes. to read a fiction book who can get into the different characters. But for a nonfiction book like America Before, it's very straightforward. For me just to read it myself. I agree. I'm a tremendous Stephen King fan, but when I read Stephen King's books, where he reads them or listen to them, when he reads them, they're terrible. <laughs> He's awful at it. I don't think a novelist <laughs> should should read their own their own novels. I think that's a, that's a job for for an actor. Oddly enough, I've just been reading Stephen King's Dark Tower series. I just, yeah, very near the end of the seventh volume of that. Yeah, I'm just a giant fan of his. But me man, too. when he reads it, he reads it like he's just reading it. Yeah, it's like oof, this is rough. It's hard to get behind.